Ramon, your daughter Mary Helen, uh, we just saw her here in the Snoozelin room. Can you just tell me uh, what this type of facility does for your daughter, do you think? Well, um, actually the whole school. Um, my daughter has severe autism and um, the school has done quite a bit for her. Mm -hmm. uh, actually, they, I don't know which, how to actually say, but they have tamed her. Mm -hmm. Like she was not listening. She, now she'll, <laughs> believe it or not, she does listen to me. Yes. And um, this room here, as you can see, she, she, she just loves it. Lori, you're the principal here at Clifford Bowie School. Yes, um, I am. Can you just tell me the, a bit of the history? You you, you had a snoozelin room here before, did you not? And We did. Our snoozelin room has evolved over a number of years. Uh -huh. And uh, just recently, we invested another $32,000 into the room. Mm -hmm. And we were able to obtain that money through grants. Mm -hmm. uh, we received some funding from the Community Foundation of Ottawa, mm -hmm. as well as uh, TELUS Community Ottawa Board mm -hmm. and School Council. And so why did it seem important to you to invest your money in this room in particular? Because of the benefits that our students get out of this room. Mm -hmm. All of our students in the building have developmental disabilities coupled mm -hmm. with autism. Mm -hmm. Some of our students have, are um, blind with low vision or deaf or hard of hearing. Mm -hmm. And this room, uh, it's a magical room where the students can come in and explore 